Guyana, located on the northern coast of South America, is ranked the third poorest country in the Western Hemisphere. There are little to no opportunities in arts education, especially for those living outside of the capital city. In September of 2014, in partnership with the Guyanese Lutheran Church, an after-school music program for adults and children will open in New Amsterdam, Guyana. The academy will be the first of its kind and will accommodate 240 students learning keyboard, guitar, voice, string and brass instruments, and percussion. This experience will be open to students of any religious or cultural background. A team of four American music educators will travel to Guyana to teach for each school year. After my five-month trip down to Guyana in 2011, I was completely sold on the experience. My friend Michael Murkison and I taught music to over 300 people a week in two of the largest towns in Guyana, Georgetown and New Amsterdam. It was such a life-changing experience for the students and for ourselves that we thought, how can we bring this experience to more students in Guyana, and how can we share this with more of our friends from back home? Uh, Guyana Lutheran Music Academy is really the answer to that question. This organization was formed with two goals in mind. One, to bring more music to more students in Guyana in a longer, more sustainable way, and to share this experience with more educators from back home. The directors of GLMA believe that music education is a positive and powerful engine for social change, developing responsible, successful, and empathic citizens. Countless studies show that music positively impacts brain development, social and interpersonal experiences, self-esteem, self-confidence, and impulse control, all contributing to healthy growth and development, especially for children and families who are experiencing marginal resources. With your support, we are making this dream a reality. GLMA is seeking contributions of all kinds, including musical instruments, music supplies, shipping materials, school supplies, monetary contributions, and the donation of your time and talents. To learn more, please visit our website at www.glma.gy. With opening date just under six months away, our volunteers both here in the U.S. and in Guyana are working harder than ever. They put together budgetary plans, marketing and PR strategies, teacher hiring committees. Our volunteers in Guyana are renovating the academy and home for our teachers, and we fundraise just over $35,000. I know this would not be possible if it weren't for our incredibly dedicated volunteers and our extremely generous community of donors. From our friends in Guyana, and from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much.